here in Del Rio, Texas, September 16th. I'm underneath the bridge. Behind me, 10,503 people. This is a crisis that is unfolding. It's a man-made crisis. Just over a week ago, there were fewer than a thousand people here under the bridge, averaging between 700 and 1,000. Then, on September 8th, the Biden administration made a decision to cancel deportation flights back to Haiti. The vast majority of these illegal immigrants crossing in Del Rio were from Haiti. When they made that decision eight days ago, the 700 to 1,000 people who were here discovered they could stay. They pulled out their cell phones. They called their friends. They called their family. And eight days later, 700 people became 10,500. This is a disaster, and it is a man-made disaster. It is the result of political decisions, and Joe Biden could end this tomorrow by simply following the law and reinstating the deportation flights back. When you have open borders, this is what you do. Let me say to the heroes, the men and women of Border Patrol, who are risking their lives trying to do a job that their political superiors won't let them do. We appreciate your courage. We appreciate your service. This is wrong. This is not humane. This is not compassionate. This is lawless, and it is inviting suffering. We're in Del Rio, Texas. It is September 16th. This is underneath one bridge. 10,503 illegal aliens. A mass of humanity that has crossed and is waiting to come into America. The reason they're here is simple. Eight days ago, the Biden administration made a political decision. A political decision to cancel deportation flights to Haiti. They did that on September 8th. Eight days later, these numbers appeared. On September 8th, underneath this bridge, there were between 700 and 1,000 people. But when the word got out that Joe Biden and Kamala Harris were no longer deporting people who came from Haiti, Suddenly, everyone who was here called their friends, called their family, and the numbers surged to 10,503. That's what's here today. It is more than the capacity of the Border Patrol to handle. This is the result of a political decision. This is a result that is indefensible. What we are seeing here, this is wrong. This is inhumane. And this is entirely caused by Joe Biden and Kamala Harris.